Thank you. Hi. Good evening, everyone. My name is Congresswoman Lauren Underwood. I'm a newly elected representative, flipped a seat in Northern Illinois, and have the honor of representing the 14th District of Illinois in the United States Congress. And when I thought about what inspires me, I think back to the so many families around this country, people who are expecting a child. And when you're expecting a child, that should be a time of preparation, anticipation, maybe a little bit of nerves, uh, but you shouldn't approach that upcoming delivery with dread, with paranoia, and with the settling in your stomach that makes you worried. Yet for so many women in this country, that's what they face. Black women are three to four times more likely to die as a result of childbirth in the United States, a statistic that has remained unchanged for the last 30 years, my whole lifetime. And so when I got to Congress, I knew that I needed to do something about that. Whether you are Allison Felix, a world champion, gold medal Olympian, a boss on the track and in real life, whether you are Serena Williams, the greatest athlete of all time, whether you are Beyonce Knowles, the queen. <laughs> These ladies have had near misses that they have been public about, where they had pregnancy complications that endangered not only the lives of their children, but themselves. I have a friend, Dr. Shalon Irving, who three weeks after giving birth to her baby girl, Soleil, died as a result of hemorrhage. Thinking about a woman named Kira Johnson, who was a pilot who raced cars, who died right after giving birth to her son Langston. And I think about Shalon's mother, Wanda, Kira's husband, Charles, and this, all the many women across this country who are speaking out as a result of this issue, these untimely deaths, and that gives me the motivation to move forward, the sense of urgency to not just legislate, but to save lives. And I know that with this generation of millennials in Congress, we're gonna be able to do just that. I raise a toast, raise a drink, to all of you change agents, visionaries, and folks that don't accept the status quo. Congratulations and thank you. Thank you.